A low mass X-ray binary, or LMXB for short, is a close binary system containing a neutron star or stellar mass black hole primary and a main sequence star, an evolved star, or a degenerate stellar remnant secondary that is transferring its mass via an accretion disk, resulting in heating of the accretion disk and thus brightening of the system in X-rays. Let's unpack this definition for a low mass X-ray binary. First thing is we have two objects. The first one is a primary, and that primary can either be a neutron star or a stellar mass black hole. The primary is located in the center of the accretion disk. You can't see the primary because the accretion disk is surrounding it. Let's take a look at the secondary object. The secondary object can be a main sequence star. That's a star that's an adult star. It's nice and stable in size. It could be an evolved star, so it's evolving off the main sequence. It's turning into a subgiant or a red giant, for example. Or it could be a degenerate stellar remnant, so it's passed all the way through its evolution, and now it's a degenerate stellar remnant, such as a white dwarf. This secondary object is this other big one in the binary system. Now the secondary is transferring its mass to the primary via an accretion disk. The accretion disk heats up due to viscosity and light is emitted from the accretion disk in x-rays. 99% of the light emitted from a low mass x-ray binary is in the x-rays. 1% is in the visible band, about. And of all the objects in the system, it is the accretion disk that is emitting most of this x-ray light. 